Hi, welcome to another review. As you can see today, I will be reviewing my Beyblade Metal Fusion Legend Midnight Ball. As you can see, I have the pieces, the tool, his online code, instructions, launcher and ripcord. Now then, I'll start off by showing you his instructions. You can see here, it opens up simply. You can see, here it shows you how you would put it together and where all the stickers go. And here it shows how to use a Beyblade, which is pretty stupid, but no one knows. And here is the entire um, Beyblade and all the pieces there. You've got the Face Sport Fusion, no, yes, Fusion Energy Ring, sorry, Fusion Wheel, Spin Track, and Performance Stick. You see here, I fold that back up again. Here we have the, um, online code as you can see here you can try and use it if you want I've already used it so haha um, here we have all the parts again face ball, energy ring, fusion wheel, spin track and performance tip so yeah and um, now I'll start by showing you um, what the bag comes with this is the launcher which you can see the nice blue colour and um, it's much better quality than the old ones, I think. Old Bay Bay launches, it has a much better grip, as you can see there, so I can just pull like that. The um, sticker's nice there, as you can see. It's got a ball on it there. R, to indicate that it's right-handed. And here is where it shows um, where the actual ripcord would go in. So if I put down there. Here is the ripcord itself, it's blue. And um, you can see it's still a little bent. Um, I might do a tutorial on how to straighten them out, but um, to be fair, the easy way of doing it is just putting the ripcord in boiling water and straighten it out. So, you know, it's not too hard. Now, I'll start by putting the Beyblade together. You can see I'll show you, um, I'll show you each of the parts first. Here we have the face ball, the same sticker of, um, ball, like on here. The only reason they gave you two is so you could indicate that this is a ball's launcher. That's pretty cool. It's a nice ready orange. You have the 125 spin track. See there. It's nice. The performance tip, which is more of a stamina, but um, has good attack. The fusion wheel. No, energy ring, sorry. As you can see, I'll show you something that... The stickers here, I don't know why they decided that they'd put them on the inside of the way there, near where you'd insert the um, teeth of your launcher. Because, you know, the stickers are really starting to peel off and it's getting on my nerves. I'm not sure. If it gets too bad, I might just take them all off by myself. But, I don't know, we'll have to see what happens. Um, this is the fusion wheel. I keep getting confused. Energy ring. Energy ring. I've got to remember. But anyway, this is the um, fusion wheel, as you can see here. It's nice. It's good for attack, I think. See there? Sorry I don't have in the I don't have the box anymore, but still. It's unassembled now, as you can see, but I'll put it together and I'll show you how. You drop the energy ring onto the fusion wheel, like that. Then you would take your 125 spin track. Well, in this case it's 125, but depends on which one you have. And you drop it in there. Then you would put your face ball in. Oh, and I don't think I showed you. This is the tool, as you can see there. It has a side here to um, put the performance tip on. And this is the side for the face ball. As you can see, if I just tighten the face ball. Make sure it's not too tight. There you go. And then you just need to put on the performance tip. Like so. And voila. This slightly comes off a little bit, so you know, I'd recommend doing that a bit tighter, but not too tight, otherwise it'll break. And there it is, as you can see there, looks very nice. Let's see. Um, like I said, this bay is actually a stamina type, but yeah, it has good attack. It said it had the stars on the back of the box indicating, but um, sorry, I don't have the box anymore. Um, what I'll do is I will get my um, base stadium and show you what it's like in action so if I just put this here and move some of the other stuff that I don't need now 
Now then, here is my base stadium, as you can see here. I'll just put the camera down a bit, and I will just. And um, for those of you who don't know how to launch or use a Beyblade, you have to take the launcher, take the ripcord, put it in, take that away, put it here, and um, now I'll just show you what it's like in action. So there you go. You see, I have the um, yellow and blue base stadium different from the other one which is um, so the whole thing is yellow and this yellow pattern is blue that one looks nice to be fair but I like this one it's nice as you can see it looks nice it actually has good attack but um you know there's no enemies in there so if it were to attack it'd move a bit faster af after collision with an enemy so, yeah this is actually my only Metal Fusion Bay. I'm planning on getting a... or well, ones I want are Rock Leon, Dark Wolf, um, Earth Eagle and Storm Pegasus, and maybe Flying Sagittario, depending on which ones I can find in the store, because I can't find my... Uh, can't find a, a Storm Pegasus anywhere. I might order it off eBay though, I just showed my dad it on eBay, he said he, he'd think about it, we'd have a look at it on the weekend. But um, as you can see, it's spinning quite for quite a long time, so yes, yeah, definitely a stamina type. And um, I never even ripped it too hard to be fair. So yeah, it's nice. So yeah, this is the stadium, I'll um, probably do a review of that after this one and upload it after I've uploaded the review of my midnight ball so yeah I think it's a really nice bay I got it from Argos in uh, Wolverhampton, Wolverhampton for £8.49 and then I went to the one in Bilston the next day to look for Storm Pegasus they had Cyber Pegasus so, and Dark Wolf and this Legend Midnight Ball you know in the end I just decided forget it I'll just buy myself a base stadium because I needed one because if you keep on using these on the wrong sort of surface, your performance tip will get mashed up. So yeah, let's put everything here which I showed you. Performance. Here we have the Beyblade, launcher, the cord, instructions, unlike cold, and tool. So that's everything there. Um, hope you enjoyed my review. Be sure to comment and subscribe and um, see you next time.